Hi everyone, it's Emmy. Welcome back to another Kiddo Craft. Today I'm going to show you how to make these. Doo -doo. And these are recycled crayons. So my boy had a big pile of crayons that were all stubby and such, so we melted them. And all you need are crayons, a little bit of heat, and a muffin tin. Alright, so I'll show you how it's done. So begin by lightly oiling your muffin tin. I'm just using a little mini muffin tin I found at thrift store, but you can use silicone molds or whatever you like. Next you're going to peel off the paper off your crayons, and I found this was a really fast way. Just take a razor blade and slice through the paper, and then the paper comes right off. Then you're going to chop up your crayons into pea-sized pieces, and for my son to do this, I gave him a little putty knife, and he was able to chop them into pieces as well. They're like little carrot slices. Yeah, you're right. You can also use a pair of scissors, or you can use your razor blade and chop them up. All of them work. Once the crayon pieces are all nicely chopped up, then you're going to place them into a 350 degree oven for 3 to 5 minutes or until the crayons are completely melted. So here they are completely melted. At this point you take them out of the oven, allow them to cool, and you can speed up the hardening process by putting them in the freezer. To unmold them, place the complete cooled crayons in the freezer, and when they're really cold, then you just invert the pan, give them a good tap, and they should just pop right out. These crayons are perfect for making leaf rubbings. To do so, you just take a leaf, turn it over so the veins are facing up, place a piece of paper on top, and then just rub your crayons right on top, and then you should get a nice little leaf image. And besides being resourceful, these crayons are really great for making leaf rubbings, as you saw in the video. So yeah, so here's to breathing new life into old things. Alright, I'll see you next time. Now go make something. Bye!